So my next one, this is going to be quite a short review, people, because there's not much information. And we're seeing this more and more often. Um, they did launch a Discord uh, about a week and a half ago. The project is Look Labs. Um, it's basically a weed growing project. Uh, but it's it's quite interesting because you've got the the game theory side of it very similar to Wolf Game, but in a, a completely unique approach to it. So it's not like the derivatives that came out after Wolf Game, which were all the same contract copy and paste. This is its own game with its completely own mechanics, um, but very very similar from the from, from the um, the fact that there's a lot of game theory and i would actually argue that the look labs is more true game theory than even wolf game um so it's it's not like anything else ga games that i've seen in nfts at all um you know you'll be given different um options at different stages different decisions that have impacts long term and different risks factors that you'll be told the risk factor up front and depending on how risky you feel or, or not you know um, it, it affects the entire experience for you with your nft i uh, might even be worth getting two and playing very risky in one and very risk adverse in the other um, because the upside of playing it risky is huge, but you could also um, potentially get nothing out of it. Whereas, uh, you know, then you've always got your backup one where you where you being careful with it. The nice thing about this is, um, so so first of all, let's just look here. There's only ten thousand followers on on Twitter. Um, <clears throat> Discord has got twenty thousand followers. No launch date. No launch price. I, I think the, it's definitely going to be 420 something, the launch part. Either <laughs> 0 0.420 um, or one, 0 0.1420, something like that. Um, I think I did, if I see it, I'll let you know. Um, the One of the founders of this is a founder of Wolfgang. So that's number one on the bullish side as far as the team goes. The team is doxxed. Um, I wasn't able to research it. And all of them are Solidity developers. So they've got experience in the space. Um, also, just like Beanie invested in Wolfgame and was sort of tweeting and punting Wolfgame, he's also invested in this project. So I think they, they're biding their time at the moment. Obviously, they need to um, add a little bit to their website because this is their website in its entirety. I don't <laughs> need to scroll. Um, it's a link to Discord. Currently, this is their website. And they've got a separate website, which is this. <laughs> so is not... And not much to go on as far as no, not much information. So you think, okay, great. They've recently opened Discord. Let's jump into Discord and let's get some information. And there actually, there's the mint price 0 0.042, which is, is really a fair price for the team um, that you're getting here. Um, and they tell you very, very little here. It says the green list is the first step in the minting process. So that's their white list. They've already had a, a raffle for that, but you can still get um, white list in Discord by, by just, you know, being nice and, and spending time there. Um, so they say here the green list will automatically have wallet addresses of Wolf Game Wolves and Sheep as well as Pixel Vault founder DAO holders um, listed. So if you hold a Wolf Game Wolf or a Sheep um, or a Pixel Vault founder's DAO token, you will automatically be whitelisted for this project. Again, because this, this team is involved in those two projects also. Snapshot of the clan was taken on January the 14th. I wonder when I bought my, my, oh. my Sheep. I bought a hey, sheep because there was there was some fud going on. Someone was, I think, Pranksy was fudding Wolf Game, and Wolves went from three to one. And I thought, okay, and I bought one at one point one five. Um, I wonder when that was because I think I missed the snapshot. Let's have a quick look because I'd be interested. Probably missed it. I mean, my luck. I bought it the day after. <laughs> but let's have a look. But yeah, a great team, um, and and really has great potential. I mean, at zero point four, I'm a I'm a taker for sure. Uh, sorry, zero point zero four. What am yeah, I looking that's, for? A sheep. Your sheep. Yeah, that's a good that's a good mint price. Like that's not too expensive at all. Like, and if you're getting so, qual if you're getting something quality like uh, Wolf Game for that price, hell yeah, I'm in. Uh, it was only three days ago. Okay. 
only three you days ago, it. but you can, you can see what I'm talking about. Uh, it just dropped, but, but they've started coming back. So I paid 1.15 and they will come back because it's a great project. I think the floor at the moment is about 1.6, somewhere around there. And I've, well, it's gone down a bit. I've got it listed for two point something small. Um, I'm not, a, you know, I don't have time, unfortunately, to play games. Um, but I did see it as a good flip and I will hold it until I get two point whatever. And that's probably cheap because um, I do think long term Wolf Game will always be noted and remembered as one of the, not one of, as the first deflationary uh, game that there was and, and that popped. I mean, their, their high was 4.8. So, yeah, I mean, whatever. Just went on a bit of a tangent. But th that is the guys behind it. It says there that you'll be able to mint. Uh, you'll be guaranteed one 420 game bud and a maximum of three other items to start the game. This will give you an undeniable head start uh, before the competition. All right. And there's really not much here. Welcome just is the normal where it just says hello to you. Updates. Let's have a look here. It's probably just a picture of a bag of a banky. Yeah, it's the one I showed you. So they're being they're trying to create suspense. Um, you know, we'll have to keep an eye on it. And they're gonna be some level of merch. Then you you're gonna be able to at some stage either start growing um uh, weed or selling weed. So if you wanted a weed factory in, in the metaverse. If you're if metaverse. you're not allowed if you're not from Canada and you're not allowed to grow it yourself, then uh, yeah, it's in the metaverse. Just to be clear, <laughs> yeah, all, all in the metaverse. Um, yeah, so I mean, for me, the team is is great. Um, you know, I would imagine that there's going to be a lot of hype later on. So I do think that this is a good opportunity to get in the Discord and get to know the guys if this is something that interests you. Um, and yeah, I'll keep an eye on it for you guys. I'll bring you an update if I hear anything of substance, if they launch a website. Um, for now, good team, good potential, a game, and that's pretty much it. But like you said, it's early, so good chance to get on their uh, their green list or their, their white list. So early's Early is always good, right? So take yeah. advantage of that now, guys.